my name is Milza and I'm from Ladakh. I'm the owner and the chef of Archa Kitchen. Archa Kitchen is a restaurant in Ladakh. So I am very happy to be part of Ladakh Festival and good times for choosing me as one of your uh, lockdown chef. So today I'm going to show you a uh, very typical uh, Ladakh uh, pasta which is called Oskyu. Oskyu is a handmade pasta made into, uh, made with uh, milk sauce with some vegetables. So hope you will enjoy. At first I'll show you the ingredients. Uh, this is white butter. We use very minimal uh, spices in Ladakhi food. So we, this is turmeric, black pepper and I personally uh, like uh, fennel, fennel powder. So, uh, is this spring onion and in the vegetables, palak, uh, spinach and then this is uh, two medium sized potatoes, carrots, spring onion for garnish mm -hmm. and the milk. And here no, this is wheat flour for the dough. So we'll start. First goes the dough. And I'm cooking on the uh, traditional Daraki uh, clay stove. Okay, now the onion is almost done. So here we'll put half teaspoon of uh, turmeric powder. Here I'm cooking for two person. So this should be enough. So after this, black pepper powder. One, one teaspoon. And the fennel. In Oskyu, we don't use uh, tomatoes because um, we, when we use milk, we don't use any uh, sour thing like uh, tomatoes. So first goes the potatoes. And the carrots. Okay. At this stage, we'll uh, add some salt. Very little salt. Now we'll add some water. So first we'll let it let this uh, potato and the carrots to cook. We'll cover it. Okay. Meanwhile, we'll uh, knead the dough. So we'll knead the dough with um, simple water. We don't use any salt or any flavor to it. And we we'll need a soft dough, not too hard or not too uh, soft. Okay, now the dough is ready. So we'll give this the shape. We'll take this much and give it a cylindrical shape first like this okay now we'll cut from here and press it like this and give this shape so this is called skew here our pasta is ready now so now we'll check the sauce at this stage we'll put uh, our spinach give it a stir we need to add some water to it so before put yeah adding the pasta make sure your sauce has enough water mm. So make sure your sauce has enough water so the pasta will it should uh, immerse in the sauce while cooking and we'll add the milk at last okay now the water has come to the roll boil 
Now at this stage, please check the potatoes. It should, it should not be overcooked. Now it's uh, first uh, before adding the uh, pasta, we need to check the salt. Okay, now we'll add the pasta. Skew. Now again, we'll cover it and let it cook for. I mean, uh, till the pasta is done. Now we'll check the sauce again. So here you see the water is almost drying up. So at this stage, we'll add the milk. This is a uh, one and a half cup of milk. And we'll give it a stir and let it again come to a roll ball. So here the potatoes and carrots and uh, the skew, the pasta is almost done. So we'll let the milk to cook for a while. So here, now the oyster is ready. So here you can see the potato is in shape. You should not uh, overcook the potato and the carrots, otherwise they lose their shape. So here, now we'll plate it. So the stew or stew is generally very saucy. It has more soup to it. So this is a kind of vegetarian uh, dish. People who are vegetarian, they prefer to eat this with the milk sauce. Otherwise, we have other versions of making skew. Like in non-vegetarian, we use lamb or uh, goat meat. And in some parts, they use yak meat also. So here I'm garnishing it with a little spring onions. And here we have other uh, vegetarian uh, skew uh, with um, seasonal vegetable and in, uh, in spring and in summer people prefer to use um, green leafy vegetables like turnips and all. So here the OSQ is ready. Well I hope you all might have liked this preparation. It's very simple yet very delicious and healthy and you can simply try this at your home. Thank you. Thank you so much.